Leonardo AI generated designs are really great for print on demand and t-shirt designs. Take this one that I made, a simple cowboy cat design. This will compete easily with the cowboy cat t-shirts that sell every day on Amazon. All I gotta do is add the word Meowdy and my design will stand out with the other ones. So today I will show you step by step how to find a niche that sells for print on demand and how to use Leonardo AI for free to generate AI images that will be great for t-shirts and how to upload correctly with the right keywords. Now to check out what is selling on Amazon you need first a general niche or let's say a topic this could be animals or jobs or pets or even an event like Halloween there is a lot of niche ideas I will google a list of pets and I guess I will go with the horse uh, so next step is to go to Amazon and search up horse shirt to get an idea of what type of designs that are selling on Amazon about horses so you can make something similar using AI let's see this one here colorful pop art horse this has 15 reviews and 600,000 BSR this shirt is selling quite well let's uh, try to take this same exact title and paste it on Leonardo AI without adding any details in the prompt just the title and click generate uh, by the way I will talk about signing up to Leonardo AI later in the video now look at this results they are not perfect of course but this last one could make a good t-shirt design also this is the worst case scenario the prompt is so bad there is no details on it now a tip that I do to get a really good prompts is to go to the home page of Leonardo AI and type in t-shirt here you will be able to see the t-shirt designs that have been created by the community and what prompt they used for example this design I will copy the prompt and change what necessary to fit my niche in this case I will replace hiker with the pop art horse and remove this one in a backpack now these designs makes a really great t-shirts and I tried only once you get 150 credits every day or every eight hours I guess and every image you generate costs only one credit and by the way to sign up all you gotta do is put your email address here and after a while you will receive an email to sign in back to Amazon and check out this t-shirt that is made by AI 100% with mid journey I believe yeah this is mid journey vibes anyway great BSR of 200,000 this shirt sells multiple times every single day and look at the date 31 of January this design was added this year and it's already proven to sell let's uh, try to make something for this in Leonardo AI so type in the community feed this shirt again and this bunny design looks good let's copy the prompt and here change the bunny to horse with flowers just like that seller on Amazon and now take a look at these results especially this last one looks so clean for a t-shirt and also the third image is good just the background color doesn't seem right for the image anyway let's say you're happy with this last one and you want to remove the background you can do that from here by clicking this remove background icon then go back to personal feed and choose the image and select no background and simply download but you will notice that this is not precisely cut I recommend you to use Photoshop to remove the background or photo P the free alternative but first you gotta upscale the image t-shirt designs needs a really good quality so go download the image now without the background by choosing original image and click download then go to this website and drop the image here and this scale option make it around 8 and click submit and in seconds your design will show up in a better quality and just download it and it's a really big difference the quality is 10 times better now in Photoshop right click on the image layer and click rasterize layer and go to properties and click on this remove background and it's not looking perfect so I will use this tool called magic eraser tool to remove what lifts from the background don't forget this will go to a t-shirt someone will wear this try to make your designs the best as possible and just like that you got a good t-shirt design that's proven to sell also don't limit yourself to only t-shirt designs for example on Etsy I sell stickers they are a very popular product take this shop have 8,000 sales selling only simple stickers that you can make easily with AI for example let's open this copy bar design and look at this uh, this uh, 28 reviews this for sure have been sold at least 200 times well in my experience 10% of people on average leave reviews now when you want to make a design with Leonardo AI like this copy bar go ahead and search up a cute sticker for example in the community feed and let's see let's take this prompt of this image this first design is looking decent as a sticker but I'm not a really big fan of this art style so let's look for another prompt okay let's take this penguin design and change what's necessary in the prompt and now that's a very good result this will work perfectly as stickers
Next strategy is to sell AI art as posters in a really good website called Displate. Like 5 million visitors each month looking to buy posters is a good opportunity to sell some AI designs. Come here to this best selling section to see what sells the most and as you can see it's not that hard to make something similar using AI. For example this is space design and by the way Displate they have really great mockups for the posters much better than Redbubble. Obviously they have a terrible mockups for all the products. Anyway, let's say you pick this uh, space design to make something similar. So this time here, type a space and look for an image that you can use as a prompt. This one for example, now instead of copying just the prompt, you can use the image itself as a prompt by clicking on image to image. You can see here the selected image as the prompt and also the image dimensions got replaced to fit a poster. And that's not a bad result here after only one try. Don't forget to try different art styles to get the best results, uh, you have 150 credits every 8 hours I guess and you have the right to use every image you generate for commercial purposes. The next designs that you can make with Leonardo AI are patterns that you can sell on different print on demand products and platforms mainly on Redbubble and Amazon. So before you make a pattern design let's see what niches that sell first on patterns. So here on Redbubble I searched pattern and I sorted this by best selling and let's see what's going on. For example this uh, sharks design looks very good on this journal. So head back to Leonardo AI and search this time pattern to get some prompts from the people who already made patterns like this design here so copy the prompt and let's change this planets and stars with the title of the other pattern sharks in the light blue and this is not a bad result but let's uh, try to find another prompt don't forget to try different prompts until you generate a design that is close from the original seller so let's check out this birds pattern and here I changed birds to sharks Alright, that is close enough to the original, this can work. Now when it comes to upload your pattern design on Redbubble, you gotta do an extra step. Let's take the phone case product for example, so come here to edit, then scroll down a bit, you will see this uh, choose pattern and click on the first one. Then just scale the image as you like, just like that. You can do that with pillows and masks and some other products as well. But uh, generally I don't advise you to keep working on Redbubble because of the latest update about the fees. T Public also added some fees but I I think it's not as bad as Redbubble. Anyway, if you wanna upload patterns to TeePublic, there is not an option like Redbubble. Take this shop for example, she sells patterns and she have over 1000 designs and a decent amount of followers, so she's making some sales. But here you can see that the pattern is not like on Redbubble, it's just a simple image on a t-shirt. And also on the other products, well for a sticker it's looking very good. Anyway, still the best place to sell patterns is Amazon, especially on phone cases. This phone case right here is making thousands of sales with this simple pattern. And look at this added on 16 February 2023, this is just a couple months ago. Most of people on Merch by Amazon focus only on t-shirts, so the other products as well have a huge opportunity. Now when it comes to upload pattern designs in your Merch account, as you can see I already did upload it here. Now it doesn't look great on the t-shirts and hoodies, but for example here on the phone case, if I just scale this up like this, you will see it's perfect for a phone case. The same thing applies for pop sockets, just scale it up a little bit and it will look great. Now one of the most important steps are the keywords, your title and brand and bullet points. Your designs will never show up to customers if you have a bad keywords. So here I found a shark pattern that is already selling on Amazon and if it sells this means it got a good keywords. For the title I will copy this shark pattern and also sharks lover. So the title will be like shark pattern for sharks lover. And don't add the product name, phone case. Amazon will do that automatically. For the brand he got sharks lover gift. So I will make mine sharks lover present a similar one. Now the bullet points I like to use ChatGPT so just take the first bullet point from the bestseller and type in ChatGPT rewrite this uh, using the same keywords and you will get a different bullet point but with the same keywords as the selling design and do the exact same thing with the second bullet point. So after that you gotta check for the trademark by clicking this icon trademark US so here you can see this uh, in search of is trademarked but don't worry it's not on 25 class it's on 009 so so it's fine. Now for description I just click on this bullet plus, uh, this will automatically make a description using the title and the brand and the bullets. You can do the same keyword strategy with all the other print on demand marketplaces. And I don't recommend you to keep spending time on Redbubble, if you wanna know why, make sure to watch this uh, video next.